Mostly these are widely used electrical broken equipments really beautiful from far I'll just show you how it looks every time I have to bend myself as I told they're all covered with broken crockery just imagine an interesting creativity out of the waste material now it became a world famous garden Hello guys welcome to my channel Roaming Devi today I'm at a place called Rock Garden in Chandigarh which is in India Let me tell you something very specific okay if you have in your home might be some broken crockery or might be some uh, let's say broken pipes or broken electrical items or anything which is broken might be your floor or something now what you do actually you normally throw those items to to the i mean dustbin or some way somebody is going to take it out right so now some uh, i mean uh, intelligent person started thinking why can't you use this waste metal into some design sculpture some idols some beautiful i mean monuments i can create and that can give an artistic look it's a very creative thinking and that's where the idea came actually by the renowned artist which which was awarded our government padma shri award award and his name is nick chand saini nick chand was working as a road inspector in the chandigarh electrical division and during his leisure time because of his creativity from his childhood he started thinking why to throw this all this waste material so like electrical materials which are broken uh, those days actually i'm talking about in 1960s uh, days actually so he, th he he thought something like he can build something artistic uh, uh, out of that then he secretly started i mean he says self taught artist you know he didn't learn from it it's just his creativity he started collecting all those uh, uh, broken uh, items uh, whatever he get from his departments or from his home or anywhere actually wherever he get he started building all those uh, uh, sculptures using those broken bangles broken tiles broken uh, uh, i mean pipes electrical equipments which are broken actually which can be recycled those items recycled items he started using it and creating all the small sculptures and secretly started building whenever he get some free time and slowly it came to the notice of uh, government and initially there was some hesitation uh, they didn't allow the place where he was building it and finally they found the beauty of those sculptures which has built it and just imagine an interesting creativity out of the waste material now it became a world famous garden this garden is divided into various uh, i mean uh, sections like terracotta um, warriors uh, then dancers uh, there are uh, i mean artificial waterfalls all the entire garden is made up of with recycled items so if you're new to my channel don't forget to click the subscribe button on my channel and see you also in my various blogs and uh, let's continue this video okay this is how the way inside the garden looks very interesting really i feel like i am in some ancient cave and these are all built artificial A lot of people are taking photographs, and it's a it's a paradise for the photographers also. The entry fee to this garden is only thirty rupees uh, in Indian currency for an adult, and uh, in in South African jar I can say six rands approximately cost. But you, you'll see the value of this, uh, you know, and the uh, the value which you get from this, the artistic, the dedication, all those things. You can get the glimpse of all these things from this garden. I see the beauty of this place. Oh wow. This is artificial waterfall which was built by Nikchan steam. Just look at those roots. I mean how it is created actually it is this is an amphitheater which is created from the waste material and you can see how the staircases the sitting places were built by broken rocks let me take some shot from the top of this amphitheater and you can see how this rocks has been created here The entire seating area is made up of all the broken rocks, uh, broken stones, and that's how the amphitheater was created. 
and it's it's so beautiful. I mean, uh, I can't express in words. As I told you, this garden is divided into several sections. Actually, I mean, uh, it has like uh, it has its own theme. I mean, each section has its own theme. and uh, like the themes as having as i told you like terracotta dancers warriors then animal sculptures also there are I mean musicians sculptures are also there and i have already shown you the waterfall so it's a very huge garden i have to bend myself I have to be careful and watchful my head and you can see this one interesting thing i'm going to show you see these are all made up of earthen pots you can see this even even this one also made up of small broken stones you can see this you can see these are also earthen pots here it's at this uh, broken electrical products which were used in this wall to, to decorate and it looks beautiful from the far mostly these are widely used the electrical broken equipments most of the walls are covered with this which looks really beautiful from far i'll just show you how it looks so go inside mind your head you just need to follow the various marks of way inside the garden it shows i have to go inside this always have to bend myself and this is where the phase 3 oh it looks beautiful it's doll museum this doll the legs are all covered with broken crockery and that's where the beauty of this artistic mind and the creativity involved in this and it looks so gorgeous i mean once you see in your eyes then you can really appreciate the beauty and the effort which was given and the thought process to create this kind of creative ideas and also these dolls there is some sound of waterfall is coming probably another artificial waterfall built by the artist of rock garden oh, it looks awesome it's there So don't you think this is really a beautiful waterfall which I've shown you? So now I have covered two waterfalls here. Look behind me how colorful this process is, uh, and you can see all these uh, materials are broken, porcelain, uh, broken crockery, or any broken items of your home. Those. those are used to build this uh, beautiful staircase and it looks like a small amphitheater so i'm going to show you how those broken pieces are used actually all those designs which i've shown you at all those areas of rock garden is all made up of broken porcelain tiles recycled materials are completely used in all these areas Yeah. And believe me, these are all made up of fished materials in terms of like recyclable 
materials. This looks like camel. We go inside. This is typically it is shown as a village life in this part of the rock garden where how the village people sit together the community feelings also shown how the ladies are cooking actually It's beautiful, right? So let's see. You can see all these pillars. How beautifully they have created. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This is the animal theme which I was showing. You can see the monkeys here various shapes they're all built with broken stones and rocks you can see here dogs here that's elephant some other animals here This is the musical theme, uh, so you can see a lot of people dancing and all their body is covered by all those broken crockeries, porcelains. One thing I feel, I mean, which is missing actually, if each of these uh, sculptures which are having various themes, if they can mention something about the theme, it will be really, I mean, uh, good. Uh, although I am just predicting based on the sculptures, this is animal uh, theme or this is dancing theme. So obviously it is correct but sometimes I feel if they could have uh, written uh, some kind of you know uh, little info about uh, the various themes then it is really going to be helpful to the tourists. So this is what I am finding it is missing uh, or probably somewhere it is written which I am not finding it. All made up of broken bangles. You can see this beautiful sculpture, which are all made up of broken bangles. I, I'll just take a close shot of this. This is really interesting, right? I mean, uh, all these uh, sculptures, I mean, the idols which are standing here, all entire bodies covered by all these broken bangles. As you know, the Indian Hindu women they wear all the uh, bangles I mean made up of glass so those broken bangles are all used throughout the body of these uh, idols which are uh, present here so and looks really beautiful from far once you go close to that then you can see those broken pieces these beautiful boards are also made up of broken bangles and you can see from far looks really nice very innovative it's very innovative here i mean all these words uh, which are depicted here these are all made up of broken glasses i'll just take a close shot of this and show you how the broken glasses are fit to all these uh, i mean uh, sculptures which are shown here So 
I hope you got a glimpse of this rock garden. It is very difficult for me to cover each and every details. So I hope uh, you enjoyed this video. Got some uh, details in this vlog, but obviously you'll get lot of uh, videos and lot of you know uh, in the websites about minor details of this rock garden and the historical. I mean the history of this rock garden and all those things you can get it. So I'm going to stop this vlog. I'm literally tired. I'm going to take some rest. And uh, don't forget to click the subscribe button, and uh, don't forget to click the like button. And see you in my next vlog. Till then, take care. Bye bye.